So you might be trying to figure out how you can add people or objects into photos on your particular iPhone. Now, doing this is actually fairly basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. The very first thing you're going to want to do though, is you want to download a different application that's basically like a photo editor. So the one I use is normally Pixart, but you can download any type of photo editing app. There's tons and tons of them available. So in this case, I'll just go and use Pixart for the time being because it's the easiest one I've just kind of messed with. So download one of these types of photo applications. And then what you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and open it up. So open up this particular app and all we're going to want to do is create a new project. So we can tap in the bottom right here and we want to go and bring in a project. So we can go and just you know click on see all and you want to bring in your first image. This is the image that you're going to have as the background. So as you can see right here, let's say I just want to bring in this really basic image that I have right here. Well, let's say I wanted to add somebody over this particular photo. Well, what I can do is I can go ahead and either drag and drop the photo in here there's also a little add button that you can basically just go through and find, which is right at the bottom. It's a little add photo button. So I can tap on the add photo and I can just drag and drop in a photo on top of this if I want to. But what I typically normally like to do is I like to go through into my photos app of my particular iPhone. And I like to find a photo that I want to go and drag the background out of. So let's say I wanted to go ahead and drag and drop this particular person, right? Kylie Jenner, whatever, from this photo. On iPhones, on iOS 16 or above, you can hold and hover over an image like this and you'll be able to copy an image from this particular photo. So now what I can do is I can make my way back into my particular photo right here, and you can see that I can actually drag and drop this particular photo and this person right into this photo, just like this. Now I can go and do this with any other option, you know, item too. I can hold down on my you know, iOS 17 icon here, hopefully, and I can drag it. If not, then there's probably some other ones too, like this one. I can hold down on this, because so nothing's working right now, <laughs> but there's a lot of other options you have, so that's just one. Maybe this one I can go and drag and drop it, and I think I am able to. Okay, so I was kind of. So I can go and drag and drop. So I can go and drag this one from the image too, and go and drop this one right here as well. And these types of applications are much better because you can just go ahead and drag and drop whatever you want to into your photo, and just like this, and it really is that basic. From here, you can export and download this photo app by just clicking download. But that's basically how it works. That's how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.